Hello, my name is Ilias Lobin, and I'm a rare coin dealer. I sell authentic ancient Greek, Roman, Biblical, Byzantine coins and artifacts. Over the years, I've identified over 32,000 authentic ancient coins and artifacts, so I know a lot about this ancient coin field. I also have an eBay store, an Amazon store, and a lot of other channels on which I sell over 6,000 authentic ancient items that are available in my store at the making of this film. You can visit my store at trustthecoins.com and you can also subscribe to my email list which is free and it gets you updated uh, uh, about what's going on with the best deals that I have and a lot of other informational um, things that are going to benefit you. So you may want to check that out. All the items that you know people get from me come complete with their own beautifully done professional certificate of authenticity and of course a lifetime guarantee of authenticity. I guarantee all of, all of the items I sell to be authentic for a lifetime. The certificate of authenticity of course features my signature, a beautiful description of the coin, professionally done, many times citing a major reference or collection. The actual coin comes in its own protective coin flip. The coin flip allows you to look at the front of the coin and the back of the coin without taking it out of the protective covering. Also it has a miniaturized description that matches the number on the certificate. So you could separate the two and you know have the coin say in your wallet and show your friends. And on the back you get the historical context of the item you purchased. So the benefits of having a coin for me as opposed to other coin dealers is that first of all I guarantee all my items authentic for a lifetime. Uh, my, my ideal is to have returning customers for a lifetime and I want to provide the highest quality of service in order to do that. So a lot of other people they don't put the time and effort to do this. So when you buy a coin from me, I, I believe to be, it to be more resellable than if you buy from just somebody that doesn't give you a certificate, that, that doesn't give you a guarantee, and that doesn't do the professional research. Plus, this makes a fantastic gift. Think about it, if this, you're giving this to your husband, your wife, your brother, your sister, uh, even if they don't know anything about you know, ancient history, they can learn a lot just from the certificate itself. So this makes a beautiful, unique gift and also a great investment. Now, nowadays uh, people are investing into a lot of things such as gold and silver uh, but I believe ancient coins are one of the big growth fields that you may want to consider looking into because most people just really don't know about it. So you may want to visit my site trustedcoins.com where I have authentic coins of uh, people such as Constantine the Great. Uh, this is Faustina Sr. Faustina I. She was the wife of Antoninus Pius. Antoninus Pius still has a temple in Rome. Uh, I visited there last summer. Also Faustina Jr. She's uh, the wife of Marcus Aurelius. I, of course I have Marcus Aurelius, but I'm just giving you ideas of different uh, historical characters that you may want to look into. Of course, Saint Hel Helena. Saint Helena was the saint that was actually the mother of Constantine the Great. A, lo a lot of people you know, that are religious would like to work, you know, get a coin of her. Also, I have a lot of coins that feature uh, early Christian uh, motifs that may be interesting for you to check out. I have uh, coins with Dionysus on them. Dionysus was the ancient Greek god of wine and merrymaking, and his equivalent uh, was Bacchus in the Roman religion. I have coins with Mars. This is, of course, an enlargement. The silver coins are about the size of a dime. This is an enlargement of a silver coin featuring Mars, nude walking over there with a victorious trophy and a spear and he's, he's nude, it's, it's really interesting. Some people that are, let's say, the Aries mythological, um, Aries astrological symbol, they might want to get a coin of Mars. That, that, that's interesting. Uh, of course we have another coin with another Dionysus over here. Um, <clears throat> We have also coins with Minerva. Minerva was the Greek, uh, the Roman equivalent of the Greek goddess Athena. Uh, you know, as the Romans, they um, they took a lot of uh, Greek gods and goddesses and they uh, Romanized them. So th th this is really interesting to collect. So she was the goddess of wisdom. Uh, her symbol was the owl. There was uh, a, lo a lot of you know worship of her going on. And of course, Zeus. Who could forget Zeus? Uh, you, you could, uh, so the Roman version is Jupiter, so this could be described as Jupiter or Zeus because the Romans, they took um, the, 
Greek Zeus and they called him Jupiter. And obviously they had they created their own stories for him too. And a lot of coins actually tell a story. Like this coin, for example, this recently sold, is a coin featuring Odysseus returning from his long trip uh, to the faraway lands of the Odyssey. And when he can, comes back, he has this little dog, Argos, who at the sight of his master, after seeing 20 years, he, he winds up, at the happiness, it winds up dying right there on the spot out of sheer happiness. So coins like this are available. I have such a variety of coins, rare, authentic, ancient Greek and Roman coins, that you may just want to check out my store, subscribe to my email list, and just really learn about history. So my site is Trusted Coins. Check it out. Thank you very much, and you have a terrific day. Bye-bye.